And the fact is that U.S. LNG exports have been a big boon to global energy security in the last couple of years. As Europe sought to transition away from Russian gas, U.S. LNG has been a big part of the energy security picture. It's important to U.S. trade partners and allies around the world. And at the same time, there are very real climate considerations at play. Hi, I'm Ben Cahill, Senior Fellow with the Energy Security and Climate Change Program at CSIS. And I'm here to talk about my recent commentary, U.S. LNG Export Boom, Defining National Interests. There's a lot of discussion about the U.S. liquefied natural gas or LNG export industry in Washington. Last year, the United States officially became the world's largest exporter of LNG. This is an industry that really just started in 2016. That was when the first LNG exports came from the Gulf Coast. In that short span, the U.S. has become the global leader in LNG exports. In the fall, environmental activists started to focus on this issue of the massive wave of LNG exports that are not only coming from the United States, but are under construction. And the argument of environmental groups is that this big boom in U.S. LNG exports is just incompatible with U.S. climate commitments. We're just coming off the COP28 conference in Dubai. The United States and many other countries around the world made a commitment to an orderly transition away from fossil fuels. And the line of environmental groups is that it doesn't make sense for the U.S. to keep exporting liquefied natural gas on this scale, and especially to contemplate building new projects that have a 15 to 20 year lifespan or more while maintaining these climate and net zero goals. So the key issue right now is whether or not the Department of Energy and the Federal Energy Regulatory Commission need to change the way that they consider proposed export projects and how they determine what's in the public interest as they consider the merits of each project. It's a really interesting debate because it touches on a broader question about the role of the United States as a fossil fuel exporter in a decarbonizing world. And it's exposing some fault lines, I think, in U.S. foreign policy and economic policy. And the fact is that U.S. LNG exports have been a big boon to global energy security in the last couple of years. As Europe sought to transition away from Russian gas, U.S. LNG has been a big part of the energy security picture. It's important to U.S. trade partners and allies around the world. And at the same time, there are very real climate considerations at play. So it's a pivotal time to consider these issues. The White House appears to be focusing pretty intently on this. There's a lot of interest in Capitol Hill. At CSIS, we've decided that it's a good time to take a look at the market, geopolitical, climate dimensions of the U.S. LNG export boom. And this commentary is the first in what we hope will be a series covering the domestic price impact, covering the geopolitical issues associated with U.S. LNG, and covering the emissions and climate impacts in some detail as well. So there's a lot to say. Our aim is to make this analysis objective, granular, detailed, and useful to the policy debate. To read the full commentary, U.S. LNG export boom, defining national interests, please visit CSIS.org. <laughs>